Blue skies means fun days. Helping skydivers with tips and techniques about safety, training and fun jumping from those who know. Hi and welcome to this episode of Blue Skies Fun Days. Every so often you see things that impress you and occasionally you see something that scares the hell out of you. I've just seen something that scared the hell out of me and I just thought I'd share it with you because it could affect you as well. It's from Dan in, um, uh, in Europe and he has a YouTube channel called Area 47 that I suggest you all subscribe to and learn about just how strong or not so strong your equipment may be. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Dian from Area 47 and in this episode I'm going to break some worn out tandem leg straps. Tandem leg strap number one. Not really bad. Some um, wear from the friction adapter. Nothing too crazy. But then we go to leg strap number two. And we have this thing way worse way worse we're going to find out in a moment what is the difference with between both uh, both leg straps uh, but i couldn't let this one in service test number one is the leg strap that didn't look uh, really bad what you need to remember is that when uh, it's brand new, Type 7 webbing has a, a breaking strength of 6,000 uh, pounds or above. Most cases is above. So we expect something that it's up to 6,000 pounds. Let's go. Test number two is the leg strap with the severe uh, wear from the friction adapter. Here is the first sample. This was the leg strap uh, with um, what I would call uh, like a normal wear. Uh, broke at uh, 3664 pounds and a brand new type 7 breaks at uh, 6000. Although when I tested the Type 7 that I have here in a loft went all the way up to 7,000 pounds. So that will be about 50%. Then we go to test number two. This is the one. And it broke exactly here at the place where there is the most severe wear. And it broke at uh, 2,632 pounds. So just for a reference, the Type 17 risers, those mini risers, uh, the webbing is uh, 2,500 pounds. So what is it? Uh, something like 70% strength reduction. Is it 70? More like 60 something. I don't know. I would call it... Uh, a good call. Thanks for watching. Till the next one. Thanks, Dan. That was most illuminating. And uh, 
for what it's worth, a while back I had a look at my leg straps and they were quite worn, so I decided to replace them. Maybe it's time you could have a look at your leg straps and see what condition they're in and uh, possibly get them replaced as well. See you next time on Blue Skies Fun Days. For more tips and techniques, click subscribe.